Hey guys, so I'm back with a new video and today's video is a fairly short video. It's my October favourites and I know I've missed I think one or two monthly favourites but to be honest, I just haven't been trying out any new things so a lot of my favourites would be kind of all time favourites whereas this month I do have a few things that I bought recently that I have just been absolutely loving. So first off, I have beauty products and even then there's not a lot of beauty products, I think 4 or 5 pieces. I'm more of a lipstick girl, I've always been a lipstick girl, but recently I've been a lip gloss girl. I've got 3 lip glosses here for you guys. The first one is this one and this is the e.l.f. Hyper Shine Gloss and I only found out that LK Mart stops e.l.f. I think towards the start of the year and I did I think vlogger but I don't think I ever uploaded it but I was really stoked that they had e.l.f. because this particular lip gloss I have had my eyes on it since I think the first time I ever like laid eyes on beauty videos three or four years ago when I think Miss Jackie Chu said that these e.l.f. lip glosses were like a dollar and here they retail for three dollars which is okay but I absolutely love this one I have two of them but my favorite one is in the colour Vixen and it's this really beautiful pink cherry colour which is absolutely beautiful because my lips are very pale, they have really no colour to them so on an everyday basis this gives my lips just a little more colour just so I look a little bit more alive so I've been loving that one. I kid you not, this one particular lip gloss I went to probably four or five Priceline stores just to find one of them I think yeah. Every single price I store went to, they did not have this particular colour. And then on my way to uni, I was in the city and I was going through these kind of really big um, office buildings. It was kind of isolated, there was really nobody there. And then in the corner of my eye, I see this like pink store and I'm like, it's a price line. It was pretty much a hidden store. There was really nobody in the area and they only had like one or two workers inside and it was just completely dead. And I was going through the rack and I couldn't find one. I just couldn't find it. And I was like, you know what? I'll just look behind each and every colour just to see if somebody might have mistakenly, you know, mixed up the colours. And there was. There was a one colour left and I was so happy. This is the Rimmel Apocalypse in the colour Celestial. And it's this gorgeous pigmented pink morph colour. It's just so beautiful and pigmented and it lasts for so long. But this is what it looks like and it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's so pigmented and it does last for a good three to four hours before having to reapply it just so you know it really looks perfect. <laughs> My most favourite out of all and it is the Maybelline Colour Elixir in the colour Caramel Infused. I believe this one's called yeah, it's in the colour Caramel Infused. First off, let's just talk about the packaging. It is so cute. It's got this lipstick sort of design, but it really isn't a lipstick. It's actually a lip gloss. I need to sit out and you have an application like that. The colour is a pink nude colour. I'm actually wearing it on my lips now. I didn't actually realise how similar the colours are until I actually swatched them just then, but... <laughs> They're pretty similar, but the Maybelline one is um, a little more sheer and a little more on the nudie side, whereas the Rimmel is very pigmented. It is probably by far my favourite and it just glides on so smoothly. It doesn't feel sticky, you don't have a very sticky feeling to it and I just love it. It feels like a lip balm. It's amazing. The last beauty favourite I have is this facial scrub and it's by the brand Pure Topia. I've never heard of them. I actually got this bottle in this really big skincare uh, bag I got a few months ago when I spent a certain amount of skincare at Priceline. So a couple of weeks ago my skin was just feeling disgusting, it was feeling greasy and I just felt that I really needed to exfoliate it. It's a gentle exfoliating face scrub which obviously means it's um, gentle enough to use every day. They have very fine sugar grains which feel so heavenly and relaxing. When you rub it against your face it feels just really smooth, it doesn't feel harsh, um, it just feels really gentle on your face especially if you don't apply a lot of pressure onto it and 
you just feel so much more relaxed and fresh it feels like you're just rubbing off all the dead skin cells so I have been loving this product and I'm actually thinking of trying more skincare products from this brand because it is I think an organic line or somewhat organic line and it just smells so heavenly I can't describe the smell but it just smells organic and fresh I guess so I've been really loving this my other two favorite materialistic items are actually shoes the first pair I bought from Target and they're these ones they're so cute I'm telling you they're just so cute they kind of like cross between loafers and ballet flats and they were actually on sale they were I think originally around $30 and they got marked down to $10 and I was really lucky because they only had a f size of 5 and 6 and I picked them in the 5 because my feet kept on slipping out of the 6 and they're just so comfortable. I did have to break them in because the first time I wore them, my the back of my heels were absolutely killing me but after a few wears, they feel absolutely amazing and they're just so cute. The second pair of shoes I purchased, you probably saw my birthday video and they are these taupe booties. They are so cute. I'm not kidding you. I absolutely fell in love with them. And if I didn't buy them, I probably would have cried. They were retailing for I think $30. Yeah, they were sale for $30. And they're just these brown taupe booties with a wedged heel laced and it's just so cute um, so that is pretty much all for my materialistic favorites now on to the kind of brown and bits and pieces so my favorite song of the month has got to be Ed Sheeran's Thinking Out Loud that song is just absolutely heavenly no words can describe how much I love that song it's just amazing and the second song is actually a cover of Destiny Child Catered to You which was covered by Tay Tiso and that song just has been on repeat because the way they harmonize and sing it is just so amazing and I've just been falling in love with it and I'm pretty sure my family is getting annoyed at how many times I replay that song. My favorite TV show of the month is well a new one it's called Live and Maddie and it's a Disney Channel TV show and I know a little childish but I've always been a child at heart and I've always loved the Disney Channel um, the Disney movies and like Barbie movies so it's no guess that I love the show Live and Maddie and the Dove Caravan is just so beautiful the second show is an oldie um, it's Gossip Girl and I know Gossip Girl's been over for a good couple of years now and the reason why I never finished it was I kind of got a little bored with it a few years back and I think I stopped at like season 5 but the last week I started watching it again and I've got five more episodes until I finished the whole series. So I'm really excited to finish it but I'm really sad at the same time because I love Gossip Girl so much. It's It's been such a journey growing up with Gossip Girl. <laughs> so those are my favourite TV shows and the last favourite of the video is what has been my favourite movie. I haven't watched a movie in so long. So long. But I think at the start of the month, I watched Clueless. And yes, Clueless has been around for, I think, two decades. It's such an old movie. Is it two decades? Yeah, two decades. Um, It's such an old movie. Some people have watched it and, you know, referred back to the movie during conversations and such. But I never actually watched it. So um, I was bored one night and I decided to look it up and watch it and I definitely like it I like those kind of chick flick movies so that is all for my October favorites and stick around to my channel I think I'll have a few videos up in the next couple of weeks and I've got exams in three or four weeks so the semester is going to be over really really soon and once that is gone I'm hoping to be uploading twice a week and doing much more fun videos because summer is around the corner and so is Christmas so you guys are probably going to be able to see how we celebrate Christmas in summer in Australia. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and click subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys very soon. Bye.